In this tutorial, we will be covering how to attach a document file to a discussion board post in Blackboard 9.1. First, you will want to save your document file to your hard drive on your computer so that you can easily locate it. I like to save it to my desktop initially so that I may easily find it for the upload. Next, you'll want to go to your Blackboard site. Now, it might look a little bit different than what you're seeing here, but just go to the, the course uh, within Blackboard and locate the discussion board, which is right here. And once you click on that, make sure you locate the correct discussion board. I'm just going to go ahead and use this one for the example. And you can go ahead and create a new thread, or it's possible you could just be responding to someone else's thread which is fine too. It, it works the same way. So go ahead and we'll just say um, create new thread and you're gonna, you know, depending on what we've asked you to do in your discussion board post, you'll probably have to write some information and then you'll go, you're gonna wanna go ahead and attach the file which is this icon right here. So locate this icon and you can go ahead and say you want to attach a file and then you're going to browse your computer so now you're going to go look for the file on your computer here and go ahead and click that and i think i have a document right here that i want to attach and i'll just say open here and you really don't have to do anything at this point in time except hit submit and that will go ahead and upload it it's uploading this file Okay, and so you have another chance to cancel out of this, but I know that's the right file, so I'll go ahead and click Submit again. And you can see, here's it brings me back to my discussion, my new thread here, all right, and it goes ahead and it makes a link to this document for me. And, you know, I can finish typing more if I like to. If I'm ready, I can just hit Submit like I would on a normal discussion board and you can see that it attached the file right here. And that's how easy it is to attach files to the discussion board posts.